have two wonderful people here with me today. I'm Stefania Spin. I'm a PhD student in experimental medicine at the University of British Columbia in Vancouver. Hi, uh, yeah, my name is Scott Tebbett. I'm a PhD scientist at the University of British Columbia. My lab is at uh, the St. Paul's Hospital, part of Pro and Providence Research. I'm here because my thesis is about biomarkers, finding biomarkers to contribute to that better diagnosing and understand non COVID. So I find the symposium useful to connect with patients, with other clinicians and researchers. Since the approach we are getting to discover biomarkers in my thesis is to learn also from patients with experience, from clinicians' expertise, and also based on their knowledge, discover molecular molecules that could be RNA or metabolites that could help us diagnose this disease. That's fantastic, very worthy work. And Scott, why are you here today? Pretty much the same. I'm... I work for an organization, the Proof Center of Excellence, and we do biomarker development. So Estefani is part of that group. And we're particularly interested in looking at sort of actionable ways to change treatment and diagnostics. So we have a variety of different biomarker solutions in anything from heart transplant through to vaccine development, vaccine responses, and all the way through to some things like long COVID. So I'm particularly here because sometimes we get embedded in the weeds of molecular stuff. So I'm particularly interested here to learn about the real world perspectives of people who live with long COVID. So that's been particularly enlightening today, at least to hear about some of those perspectives. Thank you so much, both of you, for all the work you do and, and for talking to us today.